guys, welcome back to my channel, or for those of you that are new, what's up, I'm Gia. You guys can tell my hair, she's like trying to like go away, purple is saying goodnight and go, so yeah, that's new, life update. Another life update, this video right now, I'm reacting to your assumptions about me. I asked my Instagram followers what they think about me, their assumptions about me. And this has been kind of like a trend going on, so maybe I have no creativity at all and I just bandwagon off everyone. I don't know. Who knows? Hmm. Let's just dive in. You're a big brat in real life and is just faking for fame. I think it says fame because it says fam, but for fame. Actually, well like, this is kind of like maybe biased because it's like me answering something about me. But I don't really think I'm a brat, like to be honest at all. Like I can be bitchy. And, I mean, that's about it. I can just be bitchy. But I'm usually, like, pretty, like, cool and, like, I don't know. Like, my friends know how I am. Like, I'm usually, like, a really nice person. And I just, like, don't take things too seriously. So, like, that's me. I wouldn't say I'm a brat, but... You get mad easily? Question mark. LOL what? Not really. I'm actually, like, really good at, like, not getting mad. Because, like, I try not to, like, care about things. But, like, at the same time, I get frustrated kind of really easily because I'm really impatient. So, no. I assume that you're a strong individual woman. Well, I hope so, so. <laughs> you have a secret boyfriend. No. No. Just no. You have a secret ASMR account. No. And I actually don't really like ASMR. I don't know, like, I like some sounds, but like, a lot of them just like, make me uncomfortable. So, they're not really my thing, so I don't think I'd ever have an ASMR account. I didn't even make a video for ASMR when it was like a thing, so, no. You're younger than you say. Girl, do I look like Danielle Cohn? <laughs> like, what? I get I look young, but I wouldn't lie about my age. So, let's just put that there first. May 4, 1999, on a Tuesday, 4 6 p.m. You're kind of crazy when you're with your friends. Me, my friends, crazy, like, never. We're literally, like, the most, like, relaxed people. Like, we could never be crazy. extrovert I feel like I can be both introverted and extroverted it just kind of like depends I think I just might be extroverted but with social anxiety because like I can be very extroverted but then it's like social anxiety hits bitch you suddenly can't speak to anybody or look at anybody so you like Nick Morrow because he's Italian I like Nick Morrow because he's Nick Morrow from pretty much and he's the best dancer pretty much so <laughs> You an OG believer. Bitch, I'm a believer till the motherfucking day that I die, okay? I'm, I'm a cringy 2009 believer. Like, I'm not even gonna go into it. But, yeah, we'll just go there. Your very first idol was either Justin Bieber or Shawn Mendes. It was Justin Bieber. I love Shawn, but, like, I wouldn't say I, like, idolized Shawn. I really, like, only, like, idolized Justin like in the past like I guess I like look up to him now I guess I mean, not really it's like it's like different because Justin's been part of my life since I was like 10 so then it's like we've grown up together and like as I've gotten older it's like I see him differently like more as like a friend now than as like an idol if that makes sense even though I've never met him but like y'all get what I'm talking about y'all probably have the same connection with one of your favorite artists I assume you will become a successful youtuber creator artist whatever it might be well, I don't mean to assume, but like, I assume that too, or at least like, hope so, so I hope y'all assume that too, or else, don't know what I'm doing here, so, you hate reading, 
T, I literally hate reading. Okay. Story time. Senior year, I had this class called World Literature, and literally all we do in that class is read fucking books. And like, I hate reading. Like, I just like hate it because I don't know. It takes a lot of time, and like, it makes me tired, and I just don't like it. I'd rather like watch movies or whatever. Plus, the books were like really boring that we got, so like, no. We would have quizzes on like different chapters of whatever book we were reading on every day, and it was my first class of the day, so I would just like look it up on Spark Notes or whatever, or like some other website, and they gave me a really good description and summary, and I would just read that before class. And I literally got maybe like a C or better every time so it's like i literally passed that class without reading a single book so weird flex but whatever you know a lot of big slash famous people i actually don't like a lot of people think i know a lot of people but like i really don't i don't know i don't really talk to any like social media people that are like me like i don't i'm not really friends with any Besides maybe like a few on Instagram, but I don't really like regularly talk with people like that. And the ones that I do like have a mutual with, they're not like big or anything like famous. So that assumption's pretty wrong. You're low key a hoe. You secretly stan Jake Paul. Y'all hear something? It's the crickets. Um, thank you, next. Oh, this one's like so sweet. That you're really nice and funny and that we should become friends. Um, retweet. Let's be friends, just hit my DMs. And I'm really nice, thank you, I agree. And funny. See, like, I'm really weird. I feel like I'm funny, but some people don't understand my sense of humor besides like my friends because I have a really weird sense of humor. But it's nice because everyone at school thinks I'm funny, which is like, that's a first, so <laughs> go me. Alright you guys, so those are all the assumptions that I read from you guys. Let me know what you think. Did you have any other assumptions about me? Do y'all secretly hate me? Is that how we doing this? Or if you like the video, make sure you give me a thumbs up. And also to see more content that I make in the future, you can go all the way down, hit the subscribe button, and hit the little bell button that's next to it. It's gonna go and you're gonna know when I post every Saturday. Also, go down in the description, you're gonna find all my social media, Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat, all that good stuff. Go down there, follow me, keep up with me. Share this video with somebody you think would like it. So yeah, you guys, that's it. Um, I hope y'all are amazing. And do what makes you happy. Go out, dye your hair a weird color, prove people wrong, you know. Fuck them haters. I felt like Jake Paul in that instant. I don't know why, but I, yeah, yeah. I will see you guys next week with a brand new video. So until then, peace out. Take hold of me. You're flowing through.